Why should you get the pertussis vaccine? Pertussis, or whooping cough, still kills an estimated 160,000 children a year. Most of these deaths happen in young babies who are either unvaccinated or incompletely vaccinated. Worldwide, there are an estimated 24.1 million cases of pertussis each year. A recent resurgence in numbers of infection in many countries underscores the need to keep young children and babies protected. Before we discovered the vaccine, pertussis killed twice as many children as measles and polio combined. It passes from person to person by coughing, sneezing, or close contact with an infected person. Pertussis bacteria release toxins that damage the respiratory tract, which causes airways to swell. The coughing that results can be violent enough to trigger <laughs> vomiting or cause infected people to struggle for oxygen. Adults and children can all be infected. But the disease is most dangerous for babies, who can temporarily stop breathing, which can cause seizures and brain damage. An effective vaccine for pertussis, diphtheria and tetanus was widely adopted in the late 1940s and then updated in the 1980s. It is safe, effective and has helped drastically reduce the number of pertussis deaths around the world.